I'm really liking this new camera with the viewfinder to the side because I can look at myself and touch up and everything. Ooh, girl. <laughs> hey guys, okay, so today I am back with another video this week, but this time it is going to be a DIY room decor video and I haven't done anything like this before, to be completely honest. Like, yeah, I've done a few decor videos, but it's not like... Legit. But um, yeah, since back to school season is coming up, I decided to do some room decor and organization for y'all so you can use when you go back to school. And usually when I see room decor videos for back to school or anything, they're kind of tacky and not cute or something that I personally wouldn't use for my room because it's just not my style. But for this DIY, I literally spray painted everything with gold and I was just obsessed with gold spray paint. But um, yeah, I've been really, really liking my new room recently. So um, when I complete everything, I'll give you a room tour. Um, but I'm just going to be showing you a few different ideas that y'all could do when you go back to school. <laughs> So if you do recreate any of these ideas, please be sure to tweet me at Flawless Kevin because I would be sure to love and appreciate your beautiful recreations. And if you get inspired, then feel free to share your creations too. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. Whoosh. All right, so for this first DIY, it is going to be a letter memo board, and it's so easy and so cute and so functional for your room, everybody. So first, you're gonna need gold spray paint. Actually, you're gonna need gold spray paint for all the DIYs, except if you don't want gold, you could choose for a different metal. And then I got this wooden letter from Target, and I chose the letter K for Kevin, and obviously, you could choose whatever letter or shape you want, and obviously, and literally, you're gonna spray it gold. So easy, so simple. Just make sure that you don't miss any space and cracks and creaks and crevices because we don't want any wood up in here we don't want that morning wood you feel me girl you want to have everything golden okay golden and then when you're done you could either leave it like this and it looks beautiful either way but I decided to use this for a little memo board and I just put some colorful sticky notes and put any reminders that I needed and when you go back to school you need to make sure you remember all the deadlines and everything so anyway this is the final product and it's so adorable y'all and if you try this out you better tweet me so for this next DIY it is an ombre mason jar and it's so simple and so easy you know me I like cute and easy things like my boys no just kidding so you're gonna need gold spray paint again and then you're going to be needing a mason jar which I got from Michaels for like 99 cents they're so cheap and inexpensive and you can literally do so many things with them but anyway we are going to be moving on with the spray painting part so when you do this you want to ombre it out and making sure that the bottom is like darker and more opaque and then slowly dissipate and making it more faded near the top so I kind of faded it out up until halfway that way you can see the clear part of the jar um, and make sure you take your time with this because it's gonna get wet and globby and it's gonna drip and it's not cute so you just want to lightly mist it okay that way you can get the full effect but as you can see you want to make sure you shake up your bottle and test it on something before you actually do it on the thing or else it's gonna get all wet but it worked out either way and it's so cute and I decided to put some fake flowers in it just to add a little pop of color to my room or you could also put in your pens and school supplies in it because this is a school supply DIY so you could whip one out and be like oh yes girl or I decided to put some fake pebbles from Joann's as well as this fake plant that I got at Joann's and it adds some greenery and liveliness to my room so for the next DIY, it is a memo clip, and like I said again, easy and cute. Anyway, so you're going to be needing some gold spray paint, and you are also going to be needing this giant wooden clothespin that I got from Michaels, and it's only like $3 for one, and I decided to get three of them and paint them different colors. So you're just going to spray paint it like always, and make sure you get it into all the nooks and crannies, or else it's going to have some weird places and people are gonna be like oh, you missed the spot so you're just gonna spray that and when you're done you can clip all your notes and memos and as you can see I painted this one white and it's so cute and chic and you can put your happy birthday cards your memos or whatever you want and for this I also have a tip 
that you can reuse old room decor and I decided to respray paint all of the things that I had in my room that I didn't like the color of so I got this teal peacock thing from Urban Outfitters and this white dollar dove thing from the dollar section at Target and I just spray painted it gold because I wanted some mixed metals in my room and it turned out so cute you guys so yeah just reuse old room decor and change the color of it Alrighty everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and if you did Please be sure to give this video a big old thumb up You can only give one thumb on YouTube So be sure to give a thumb up if you liked this video and be sure to click the subscribe button down below if you are new to my channel This video was also a collab with my good YouTube friend Cartney So be sure to click on the description down below for her video because she's doing some cool back-to-school videos as well And if you do go over, please be sure to comment flawless Kevin sent me here that way you can show her some love and and everything so be sure to check her video out and subscribe to her as well and without further ado not further ado and until next time stay flawless and hope y'all have a blessed day bye